Cool. You ready to do this? Yes. All right. <laughs> Nightwish. 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 Did you hear that burp that came out with it? No. It sounded like a growl. I thought it was a queef. It sounded like... Sometimes good. the rock just has to bleed out of me. Yes. What's up? Long time. No see. Yes. We have not Maybe forgotten about you. the Nightwish Army. We actually just did a Nightwish live wow. not long ago, like a week ago, guys. We're, yep. We have been... Our internet finally got fixed. That's right. That's what I was getting ready to say. Yeah. We have postponed our Nightwish Wednesdays until our internet gets fixed. Mm -hmm. It just got fixed. Yep. We did a Nightwish reaction live, live mm -hmm. um to kind of get back into the swing of things yep. we did have to postpone the wednesday this week because we had to postpone last wednesdays because we had tornadoes yes and then the tornado sirens were going off it but, was crazy that that warm weather going into bitter weather it got has me sick now yeah, i've been so, sick for a week guys so guys what so we're we gonna had to do postpone this one day because i'm sick we don't do things normal no. but what we do do tonight i said do do what we do <laughs> tonight is going to be that night wish <laughs> ghost river that's the next on the list mm -hmm. that gabriel gave us guys and we we're are still both, we're back at Vakken. yes Vakken. We are. this one is back at Vakken in 2013 yep. Yep. that is the open air festival um those of you that have been following our night wish journey guys we are going right down the list that gabriel gave us yep. we are going to veer soon mm -hmm. and because we are dying to hear the poet and the pendulum yep we are Anxious to see you all. We can't wait to have some amazing lives. But until then, you guys can subscribe. And ring the bell so you know when we drop that night wish. That's ish. right, because we're in it for the long haul, guys. Mm -hmm. And until then, we want to raise our glasses. Let me find my glass. Ooh. You guys know how we do. We're going to raise our glasses. We want to toast those haters out there. Mm -hmm. All right? And the reason we do this is because we don't re-hate around here, guys. We like to show mm -hmm. the haters love and positivity. That way, maybe that can rub off on them and they can actually join yep. the positivity train and yep. feel what it feels like to be that that just that person that, that light. loves life show them haters show them trolls show them all that yep. you know mm -hmm. you are you no matter what they do and mm -hmm. you're going to keep pushing that positivity yes. and mm -hmm. uh let's try to spread that yeah because if we re-hate then then we become one of them that's right you ready mama i'm ready up top Woo! down low Woo! double barrel holes uh, 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 uh. Oh, she give it the corkscrew. <laughs> yep. Nice. Creative. But I am pleased to know that this one I'm going to be witnessing. Yuka, my favorite drummer of all time, as yep. of right now. And isn't the new one? Isn't that that was his Yuka's pro, mentor? Uh, his mentor. Yeah, yes. I guess Yuka was his protege of some of sorts. Oh, that's so at that's least, kind of that's what, sentimental. Yes, that's yes. what um, at least some of you have told us. And yeah. thank thank you to you all who go to the comment section and let us know. You know, if we're off on something yes. or if we don't know something, and, and thank you for Let doing it. Let us know it. respectfully. And thank you for doing mm -hmm. it with respect and not, yes. you know, being those people that are like, hey, dumbass, and Take you expecting, to the slaughterhouse. expecting us to know everything yeah. when this is literally, you know, we're probably like the fifth, sixth time we've heard mm -hmm. Nightwish all together. So, yeah. mm -hmm. all right, this is Nightwished Ghost River Vakken 2013. 2013. 2013. 2013, 2013. You like that? Mm -hmm. That was manual echo and I reverb. It. I love it. Uh, Oop, er. <laughs> we're going to act like that didn't happen. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Give me some kind of 80s vibes. Yeah. 
that double? Oh yeah, he's doing that's oh, his oh, that's his double bass. Yes. That I'm telling you, man. And I, I know there's I a lot of I love that little detail in there. There's a lot of drummers out there that can really do that mm -hmm. and credit to the whole band for being able to stay on tempo with yes. that and doing those stutter switches like what yes. they were just doing in there. And they're so versatile in just one song, but they're versatile from song to song, too. Oh, my god! Like, I, that's why I love doing Nightwish, because you never know what the next one's going to be. Absolutely. They all even sound Even if it's different. from the same, same time frame. Yeah, like yes. even from the same show. Yes. yes. I knew when it had that 80s feel to it, I had a feeling that they were going to rock the fuck That's out on metal. this one. This is yes. metal as fuck, that, isn't it? Didn't When it started, didn't it give you that kind of 80s kind of rock not, vibe? Not quite mo 80s. Modern. Not modern quite now. 80s, but it had that back, yeah. back, like old school, like metal that, yeah. like, you know, I would, I would probably place it more 90s metal type of stuff. Okay, but, 80s, 90s. I was, yeah. I was born in 1990, so I don't know exactly yeah. where to place it, but I knew it was in Absolutely. that Absolutely, but it, but it, 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 it gave me that kind of like that Megadeth feel, the way they, mm -hmm. they were doing that with those Dave Mustaine yeah. guitar riffs. Uh -huh. they, I don't know, or maybe even a little bit of an Iron Maiden feel they were in so there, cool. which is kind of that. And older... then he would throw in that double bass, yeah, that, like you didn't expect it. That was and that it was, was really. Cool. It was at such a unique moment. That's not easy to do. How about Floor's growl, I her know. rasp, for her to be able to do I that. I called it a scream, right? But, well, it, yeah. it was, but I'm just saying, yeah. for her to be able to do that, yes, that. Uh, just those she did it in those mid. opera 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 type yes. stuff for her to be able to yes. do that symphonic type stuff and then go to and, but be, be, still be able to do that metal stuff yes. like that oh my god in and the then, same song and not to mention yeah then they switch uh -huh. and then here comes that. Oh, we got to get that switch yes, again. I love a feminine and a masculine voice coming together, especially oh, he kills it. especially in rock. This There's guy, just nothing like it. This guy kills it, man. Yes. He really does. And his, his freaking bass is sick, yes. too. Look at that thing. He does it on that ride. That It's it. got like that, uh, the lyrics have got like that Ra mystical fairy, yes. like that fairy tale type, you know, like, mm. like draw to them where yes. it's very. A lot of their stuff has that. How they're using fantasy. that. Fantasy. I like that, that hey you, yes. child, child of rape. Yes. And the Snow White and uh -huh. like a man that they're grimy yes you know what is. I this, mean? Is a, this is the grimiest song but it's heard very so far. it's very poetic too it's how yes. they like how they do the symphony stuff mm -hmm. with the metal you Versatile. know they're doing the same thing with the lyrics in yes. this one and, and then like, floor came in yes you know what i mean and yes. did the like the switch with him real yes. quick man that was and, I, and even though he kept saying the same thing over and over again with the down down deeper down oh, i loved it yeah most of the time that would drive me crazy because in a lot of americans mainstream music they'll do that so much and it gets old i'll get like my add kicks in and i'm i'm like on to the next thing this one was like yes give me more he give was 
was me driving. More, give me more. He was driving that rhythm, that like yes. that rhythm section with even with the and vocals. And then her voice and then on hers top of was it, lacing that melody in there. Yes, that and then was really cool. I like how he was uh, repeating the down word yeah. and how he did it, the down, down, deeper down, and kind yeah. of reminded me of like a Rob Zombie type of hook. He had a little bit of that yeah. uh, flavor in there. Yeah. yeah. Proud. Okay, so wow. she. Okay, they have Dream wow. and Scream with a with a, a thing, but, but you know, in between it. So does since they're going together in that moment, does she say Dream and he says says Scream? Because she's kind of going over more of the positive things, and he's kind of saying more of the, you know, not necessarily negative, but you got to yeah, I didn't look at like it the like the darker that. I and didn't the lighter. look at it like that. It could have. I mean, because they don't say both words. Because they don't say dream and scream. No, it's separated. Yes. They're trading so, on it. They're, uh, they're, but they sing at the same time in that part. You'll have to take it back and yeah, see. Yeah, I'm definitely going to take it back. She, I thought she was that's trading creative, with him. That's creative as hell. If that is what's going on, she says dream and he says scream. Because, like I said, she's talking about lighter things like yeah. the Mermaid's Cove. And he's talking about, you know, like he said, the, the rape thing and all of that. And, you know, drown, drown, you know, deeper down. And she's talking about, you know, the kinder heart and, and just the lighter things. And, and she, her voice is, yeah. is going there, too. And his yeah. is going real, you know, grimy and well, raspy. Let's, let's listen to it. How cool would I, that be? I think that I thought she was just trading with him mm -hmm. that, front, that front word of the, both of those lines. But we'll mm -hmm. check it out. Yeah. I love that vibe that they're getting. Yes, I love that kind of how she does that. Yeah. I think she said, believe it. And he said, we live as we dream. And she started doing uh -huh. like the, oh, like the, right. like a real screaming Well, they growl. were going both at the same time. And the way that they put that word yeah. there, I know that he's not saying dream and scream at the same time. I, I mean, I, we wouldn't think, because they wouldn't put that there in the lyrics like that either. Yeah. So they must be, one must be saying one and Probably. one must be saying the other at yeah. the same time, though. Yeah. 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 Oh no, they were showing they were showing a uh he says dream and she started screaming oh, in the okay. background. So that was marking gotcha. marking the scream. Gotcha. As far, that's what I think is going okay. on because I did I, I Yeah, don't that think, makes sense because she did scream. But I see at what that you part. were saying. Yes. I see what you were saying. Yeah, I can hey, that see. That would it. be cool too if that somebody did both that. Both yeah, that yeah. Was, either way, that was badass what yeah. they how they just did that. And yes. they had that like it's, it's still symbolic for a scream. So Yeah, they had that like that almost like that Pantera yes. type of just that Pantera type of type of vibe in that hook right there yes. where they just I love it man because I'm a, I'm an old school Pantera fan mm -hmm. you know that walk love all that good stuff man they got some good vibes. <laughs>
That was amazing Woo! the way he led into that. And he said, he said, uh, I am the sand in your hourglass, uh -huh. yes. every leopard child. I am the desert scape. Uh, I am the sand in your yes, hourglass. Yes, and he said, when he said uh -huh. that, when he said that, uh, I don't know if he said the eyes sewn shut first, yes. but he said every leopard child or yeah, he, every leopard uh, children or whatever yes, he said. Yes, the eyes came next. And then he, and then the. Children. Children in the background started chanting. Yes, that, what he that, was yes, that rhythm earlier. hook and the, oh my god, how freaking creative was that? If you can't tell, this has got us like super. Oh, I'm pumped on this. Like, this is my this is my because I'm shit. so excited. This yeah. is my shit right here. We're gonna take that back and re-listen to that. We're gonna redo. This is definitely my favorite so far. Redo. I am the desert scape, the sand in your hourglass. Yes, my, yes. <laughs> that tempo switch that they did. Yeah. Why out in our desert state? Send in to your now the class. Why out in our fear with the ghost? Let's go to the gates to shit. That's legit. Yes, Yuka. Yuka, I, I keep wanting to say Juka, but Yuka, I loved how he got up and was like, fuck yeah! Yes, that was badass. Yes! By He's far. like, my calf is in a damn, uh, what's it called? Uh, Charlie horse? Yes. Cramp? Yes. Yeah, no, I, I would have been in what they call cardiac arrest. Because that's where they do that double bass, right? Yeah. It's with your foot, yeah. Yes, both, both, they'll help. What he has is, when you, when you have that, you'll have three pedals down there at the minimum, but mm -hmm. you have three pedals down there, depending on your setup. Two of them will be on your... Uh, you'll have on, for your bass drum, which is the big one mm -hmm. on the floor, nor, or they have two bass drums set up mm -hmm. like that. Either way, they've got two pedals for that, gotcha. and then he'll have a pedal over here that yes. will control his hi hat as well. Oh, cool! And so, I mean, the the footwork that some of these drummers can do the fact that you can do all that with the drumming, yes, I and mean, the, the footwork too. That's what I mean. That's the pat your head, rub your belly. Drummers are so underrated. Doing, <laughs> they they they. 
You're so talented. Yeah, I know. Drummers are so underrated in yeah. bands, in my opinion. I mean, yeah. I don't let that slip. I'm, I'm obsessed with the I'm, drummer. Absolutely. I remember I was a cheerleader in, in high school, and the band would be playing, and, you know, high school songs. Yeah. Uh, they're not, like, rock songs or anything. But I would always be paying attention to the person on the drums in the very back. The percussion oh section. Oh, my gosh. And stuff. It I've was always, always been so a fan. Good. Yes, I've always been They would been always be doing the most it's, and be like going. Yes. Like it's crazy that they get put in the back so much yeah. and people don't really pay attention. Yeah. Like from what I've seen anyway. I, I, really, I would be the only one sitting there like. <laughs> I first got my first love mm -hmm. for drums through Tommy Lee. Yeah. And his flamboyance. I just wasn't born yet. <laughs> made me just, I was just like, wow, yeah. man. You know, he had the drums spinning over the crowd. Yeah. And, you know, he wasn't real technical or nothing yeah. like that. He but was just a showman. The, the, yes, I love the flamboyance of the drummers. And, yeah. and, and it really solidified it when I fell in love with Metallica when I was younger and Lars yeah. Ulrich. I love Metallica. He is a I very, grew up listening to Metallica. He's a very good showman. Like, mm -hmm. he doesn't let the drum be you know in the background right. like he brings them out and i feel the same way about mm -hmm. yuka here with nightwish yes. like he really puts them in yes. your face and he's a they part have of him that, raised up he's yes. a part of that band mm -hmm. and he you know whether he's in the you know literally in the back on yes. the stage or not yeah. he's out there and you can feel his yes. his passion he demands through his attention. performance and each one of the members not to take do. away from any other the other members That's what I was just about I, to say, I, each of the i'm just a drummer fan they mm -hmm. are all amazing yeah. at what they do this they, like we I'm, were just talking about the double bass so that, i'm so yeah. just hyped that we watch mm -hmm. this this is this is our favorite right now it's my yes, favorite it's my favorite so far oh, and yeah. i know a lot of you are going to be like oh come on because there's been a lot more technical yeah. stuff that we've heard vocally yeah. floor is amazing on yes. the, but to see her range from those screams mm -hmm. to that just yes opera style mm -hmm. singing on here i noticed you know she, jaw she did, to the floor i floor gas yes. all, all <laughs> over the floor she did the rasp on the r's in the middle of the yes. the first sentence and then would go into the next one which would be an L and and would go in into that rasp with the amazing, L. It was amazing the way yes. they did that. Yes. Oh my gosh. They, mm. th that was amazing. Yes. Mm. All right, Nightwish Army. Yes. Y'all know what time it is? I'm excited. It I'm is. always excited for this part. But yes. This I'm is this is our favorite part of the one. video. Those this one's got me like hyped to write poetry right now. <laughs> those of you that are still watching. Mm -hmm. We thank you yeah. for watching this video. The Nightwish Army, a lot of the Nightwish Army, they're in it for the long haul. I love it. They're when, in it for the art. I love it when you guys come yes. in and you keep going past the actual song and yes. you guys get into the segment we like to call Bar of the Day. That's right. Or Lyric, or lyric of, of the Day. day. Whichever you want, whichever you yeah. prefer, depending on the genre. Guys, this is where we'll I call myself. It poetry Bar of the Day. <laughs> this is where I, myself, my beautiful wife, we pick what our favorite bar our favorite lyrics are out of this song we tell you what they are and why and then it's your turn, turn to go to the comment section you leave a hashtag lotd or botd whichever you prefer so we can pick you from the crowd and let you let us know what yours is and, and don't forget if you feel the need i mean you can just leave your bar of the day if you want but let us know kind of why like yeah. why why you like that is it just because yeah. of how they wrote it yes. does it just sound awesome yes. or does it touch you in a specific way like and i don't way. and yes yeah, just that's whatever the beauty floats of, your boat yes that's the beauty of interpretation and this is a judgment free zone here. absolutely even with our comment section yes we will have trolls under the bridge as he says um but we will never allow bullying in our comment section absolutely either absolutely not if i um, see it i will delete it exactly so and just if we haven't seen it just bring it to our attention and we will delete it all right <laughs> everybody here we go so we're gonna go with the same one um, mm -hmm. I probably could have picked a different one, but we both like the same one yeah. and our videos tend to run quite long, mm -hmm. especially when we do the bar of the day segment. Yeah. So we're going to go with the same one today. Yeah. And I think you guys are, got two parts. Though. You're not going to be surprised because we mm -hmm. kind of hyped over it whenever the song was going on. I'll yeah. let her start it off. Yep. I am the desert scape, the sand inside your hourglass. And the second part is I am the fear and abuse, the leper children, every eye sewn shut. Yes. Now, mm. 
the just the meanings that you know that you yes. can pull out of that. I am mm-hmm. the desert scape, the sand inside. What does that mean? Like a desert scape? That's just nothing but hell. Yes. Nothing but hotness. Just Death. endless nothing. Yes. You know the sand inside. Dehydration. The sand inside your hourglass. Mm-hmm. You know yes. that's everybody's fear of time running out. Yep. Don't have enough time. Mm-hmm. Anxiety. Yep. You know aging. The, the unknown. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like that. That inevitable uncontrollable obsession thing mm-hmm. in your life and that is that we all have to die one day one mm-hmm. day time's going to run out yeah. and then he even furthers it with the i am the fear and abuse the, leper, oops, the i am the fear and abuse the leper children and mm-hmm. you know back in the day leprosy and I obviously yeah. still today if it was mm-hmm. a thing you know they would shun yeah. people with leprosy from the entire city the village yeah. you they know were you, you went near them mm-hmm. you know you would catch it and it's like yeah. it was like cooties on the playground yes. you know what i mean and that right there is nothing but fear and abuse yep. and then he ends it with every eye sewn shut he is every eye shown sewn shut he is the entire He's world the blind. blindness He's the sheep to what the needs followers. to be seen yes. that's right you know mm-hmm. him embodying all that with that deep vocal that deep yes. just death metal type of yes. that was epic that's then, that's that's metal yes, guys and that was metal for, as fuck. like i was saying talking about the lighter side of all of it and you know the kind-hearted you know heart and and then the you know the beautiful and this and that and how she was doing it with her voice as yeah. well i loved the it was the, the contrast yes was, but it was, it was amazing there was so much balance but she what she's talking about is you have to go across that bridge and not not let fear is the bridge yes you can't let the fear stop you from going over that bridge of individualism yeah. of living your truth he's coaxing of, them of, trying to yes. trying to put that fear in them yes. to you know oh, come here and you're yes. gonna you're gonna meet me it's and the she's conditioning like, she's yes. like go through them yes. you know i'm digging it all right yes. guys let's listen to these bars the way nightwish intended it i freaking love this song and the way they transferred we will go that. down we will go we will drown drown deeper down yeah. that's what they're scared of that's what the children are scared of if they cross that bridge that they're gonna they're gonna fall off and they're gonna drown that's amazing mm. yes. drown in fear yes you know it's it's mm-hmm. the, you, and yes. you can't even do that you, in real life yes even if you don't cross the bridge you are living in it you're that's drowning right. in the fear but you don't think you are that's you right you think you're safe in your in your little comfort zones of conditioning that's right and because everybody else is there as well so you know there's not going to be anything like you're not going to be treated like you have leprosy you know what i mean like you're not going to be treated like you know you're the diseased one the crazy one the whatever yeah. so you feel like you're you know like you can live your life in this little little bubble this little comfort zone but, that's but not really living. it's suffocating that's right mm-hmm. all right guys that was nightwish ghost river from Vakin 2013. I yeah. I mean, mm-hmm. obviously we've only heard the one other performance. Um, I can't, and it, it escapes mm-hmm. me what, where it was the last time. But this, nothing so far, just I can't Mm-mm. see anything comparing to the energy from this Vakin 2013, know. you know? I know. And to keep in, keep in mind, everybody, that this is live. Yeah. This is how they sounded live. Like mm-hmm. that sounds like, you know, you know, like right. they say on Step Brothers, it's okay, mine's not movie quality. Right. You know, this shit, is yes. soundtrack you know see, what i mean see we're used to in america we're used to even though something might sound good on record we're used to people lip singing well it, or just not sounding good live i've seen so many mm-hmm. bands like i've i've seen a, i can't even list how mm-hmm. many bands i've seen live i've just loved music my mm-hmm. whole life but there's been uh, countless that perform live and you're just like what the <laughs> like you know yeah. what i mean like yeah. well how can you mm-hmm. how can you put something out like that they're winded and then come yeah. out here and, mm-hmm. and just not even necessarily even the performance just mm-hmm. the sound of it yeah. like they can't meet 
the the yeah. pitch. They can't carry. Yeah. They can't hit the same note. Yeah. You can tell that they auto tuned. You can tell that they. You're like, you who know, the fuck is this? Yeah. So it, being able to see bands. Am I at the wrong concert? <laughs> being able to see bands and artists yeah. and stuff, just be able to actually perform their mm-hmm. craft and yes. perform it live like that. That's mm-hmm. true art artistry. And to we me, we've seen so. a lot of amazing amazing concerts Absolutely. too, where people have been able to. And that's people. Absolutely. That's people living their truth. They're not just doing it for that coin, or they're not doing it because they just want and, to be entertainers because that's fine and each has just their to own be an entertainer. absolutely yes. it does it has its time yes. and place for it but <laughs> yes. but when you expect something you you know it's it's hard to it's hard to beat people's expectations mm-hmm. so yep. but regardless guys that was an amazing song yes. we thank you all so much we love you well, i know we're running long so if you have not please subscribe and ring the bell so you know when we drop that next night wish hot ish that's right and don't forget to leave your bar of the day in the comments yep. leave the hashtag botd I'm excited. or lotd so it's our favorite part and guys yeah. before we get out of here we need to let each and every one of you know that you are important in this and you world. are beautiful and you are loved get out and do something that's all about you today not about not what not what society wants you to be. She loves you, English. Yes, you cross that bridge. You you do not let right. fear keep you from being you. And if you're lacking a, a sharp knife or, the, mm-hmm. or a pair of scissors, I will clip those stitches in your eyes. Don't need to be mm-hmm. sewn shut no more. We will yep. we will help you see. Yes. That's right. Spread that and love. Spread that positivity yes. because that's what's going to do it. And people don't always understand symbolism either. Um, and that's the beauty of this band, I feel. Oh, and I meant for real. I yes. was going to cut your eyes open. <laughs> No. Well, it's not, you know, specifically your eyeballs because people are like, I got my eyeballs they're open, just, I can see. Yeah, they're especially, just, they're you know, blind to the world. Yes. They're blind to what's you being have to put open in their your, mind. You have to open your mind. Open your third eye. Mm-hmm. All right, your, guys. Your third eye can do all kinds of tricks. <laughs> That's all we've got for <laughs> yeah. you today. We will see you guys right back here tomorrow. We love each and every one of you. We're going to be just as real. Peace, later, guys. guys. Hey everybody, hope y'all enjoyed the video. Yes, and if you want to get more involved with the videos or the channel, you guys can check the Patreon link in the description. We appreciate your support so much. And remember to subscribe here and you can find your favorite artists in a playlist right down here. Later. Peace, guys.